Welcome back to Inside Our RV, everybody. We thought we would uh, make a uh, maybe a fun little helpful how-to video on what it is that we're doing. Our place is a complete disaster right <laughs> yeah. now, but it, there's a reason to that, yeah. and we're going to get into that right now. So okay. I'm going to let Abby lead I'm us I'm going to come Brent, come back here. Okay. I call this the black hole abyss, okay? If anyone else has this problem, you know you need things, so you stuff them in, and then over time, it ends up looking like this. <laughs> Everything's wrinkly and no good. So I am going to repurpose this one. I find this hard to get into. So why I'm, is it hard to get to? Tell them why. Well, because it's it's just narrow right here, and then we also usually have our hamper, and then we have our okay. shoes down here. So it just sort of it goes way back, and it has a bar, but it's not long enough for clothes. So I'm going to repurpose that. I'm going to make that sort of a storage for things that we don't use as much. Okay. So um, you know, toiletries, extra toiletries, eye solution, that kind of thing. So I had all my sweatshirts and everything up here. I'm gonna I'm gonna change that and I'm gonna move it to the front, to the back. This so is the front. Tell them what it is that we're doing though, and and just kind of keep everybody up to speed, catch everybody up to speed. We've been in this for just over two years now. Yes. In, in our Kodiak. Yes. And really, what we wanted to do was kind of do a spring clean. Correct. Clean out, to get because you have you you start accumulating a lot of things. Yes when you're traveling, yes. you pack a lot of clothes, like you pack extra things, those start stacking up over time. And then, then eventually it's things that you don't get to, or maybe you just never end up using them anyway. So that, what we wanted to and do- And so many times we end up someplace, we need gloves, we need a hat, you know, yeah. it's not supposed to be cold and all of a sudden it's freezing. Yeah, so I want to have that stuff in here. Yeah. So packing all that in such a small space, a challenge it is a challenge but you learn as you go you learn you as do. you go so what we're going to do what we're doing right now is we want to kind of thin out we, we're pulling everything out yeah we're going through everything and we're going to thin out what we don't need yes and put away everything that we do need uh so that's the that's the purpose of what we're doing and we yes. wanted to share that with you guys so that's why it looks like a mess yeah just because you get things organized doesn't mean that it doesn't need to be redone i mean so it gets disorganized it, while you're out while camping, you're camping and while you're traveling yes like these are our bins for the pantry this is obviously our very fattening uh baking <laughs> baking basket right here yep this is my basket that i usually put all my rubs in i'm constantly taking rubs out of there that mm -hmm. i don't longer no longer use anymore, you know, like commercial available rubs. And I'm making room for my rubs, yep. you know, some sauces, um, herbs and things like that. So going through, shuffling it and uh, putting back in there what it is that I know that yeah. I want, that I know that I'm going to use. And Instead in, of all the things that like I might use you might this use, one day. There are a lot of things too that you think you have to have and then you realize I never use that. So like we have four forks, four knives, you know, that's all you're going to need unless right. you have a big family. So take well, only what you need. Yeah. So we're going to take everything out. <laughs> That's what we've been doing. Taking <laughs> and put everything, everything out. back in so, a more organized fashion. So Abby is working on the cabinets back there in the yes. bedroom, but she is also working on the cabinets back here. Do you want to show them this back here? Yeah. So, so our woo. bathroom is in the back of the RV here. Yeah. And it's taken a while to get the, you know, the organization right for toiletries. We have this down. It's a mess still but our clothes fit great in here. And then this is gonna end up becoming storage for my hanging clothes and our yep. towels. And what, what did this used to be? It Tell used us. to be like all the medicines, all the like extra toilet paper, extra yeah. Kleenexes, extra the eye solution. Plastic bins that were in there. Right, and it was fine, but we just weren't using it every day. And I wanted to get a little bit more hanging room. Again, that one's not tall enough for, for a, hanging. A, a hanging shirt. So. And then this one is still his closet up there. Yeah, part some of, it. of my shirts up there. Yeah. yeah so, so we use this for our clothes. This is where, like, see, we ended up. I built this shelf right here. Yes. Okay. Because whenever you buy this Kodiak, this is just an open space and you can hang clothes up there, but we would rather stack our clothes. So I made this shelf. We've got these bins, underwear, socks go up there, shirts, pants, shorts go down here. And it's especially great for the big haul for when we're going to be gone for a couple of months. So again, that's when you really have everything in here. <laughs> oh yeah, so you're but packing you can, for summer and winter. I mean, we have this and, and it's worked for us, but look at it. Yeah. It's a mess. So is so, that going up into the front then? 
honestly, this, I have plastic bins in the back that are smaller that have lids and this stuff is all going to go in those. Okay. So it's organized and then it's, again, it's not stuff that I use every day, but I want to be able to have in here. So yep. okay. I think it's going to work great. Well, I'm and, and uh, the toiletries, you never know if you're going to go inside and take a shower. So I kind of always have something that I can take. Right. And um, I had it down here, but it's going to fit in this drawer. So I just clean this out yep. and that is going to go in there. And then my toiletries are ready. And if I go in someplace, I just pick it up and go in. Great. We're going to get there. All right. Well, so that's what you're working on. Yep. And so what I've been working on is the pantry. This is our pantry right here. Okay. Um, got this thing that we hang on the door it just kind of gives us more room to put you can see there's like spices and things that up there. thing has worked out so yeah. well it's a shoe rack right it's a shoe it, rack. it was designed for shoes but yep. abby had that idea to hang it on here and actually use it for things like this light stuff that doesn't put Correct. a lot of weight on the door but stuff you want to have access to quickly so like i have a bin with canned goods there's actually two bins with different canned goods we have a we have a bin with different sauces in there uh, this is a bin that has like rices and noodles that we use for cooking, extra things up there. Just going through everything and thinning out the things that has been in there for a long time that we haven't used, making room for the things that we know that we're going to use. Just kind of reevaluate everything that we have. And, and we're constantly taking things out of the Kodiak that we're, that we know that we're not going to use. So I'm notoriously cluttery. I don't want to be. I don't want to be. I don't like it. And then when but. we're on the road for a little while traveling, you know, if we're gone for a couple of weeks, things eventually just start kind getting messy accumulate. and piled Thank up. You. And you're like, ah, we get home, we're going to clean it up. So that's what Honestly, we're doing right now. Honestly, get some of these. These are the best things ever Yeah. because they fold down flat. But if you need to carry something in or you need to do a picnic, yeah. right there. Well, like this guy right here is a great example. So what this actually is, this has evolved into my baking kit. So all the things that you would use for baking, flour, sugar, brown sugar, cocoa powder, these are just some things that we had picked up, and, you know, for making different desserts or breadings or biscuits, whatever, like all stuff that kind that of stuff. Stuff that you do when you actually have the time. Right, <laughs> but since it takes up a lot of room, yeah. we put it in this bin and when we're done, when we're done, when we come home, I actually grab that, take it inside and that's the same stuff that we use inside Yeah, because well. that sugary stuff you don't want to leave in. Yeah. So we're going to continue getting all of our organization done. You can see we've got stuff out everywhere. We're going to get it reorganized and everything put back together. We'll get, we'll show you how it looks when it's actually clean and ready to go. Yes, we will. And then uh, <laughs> I don't want to Abby yeah. actually wants to uh, make another video uh, later about redecorating in here. So she has plans to change colors. You can see yes. she is decorated with the uh, the black and white checkered color mm -hmm. and the she's white's not working out for me ready for a change so she <laughs> yes. has been uh, ordering some things and she's yep. going to do some decorating so we will show you that later yep. whenever we get to the uh, redecorating as well oh it feels so nice to go through all this stuff it does feel good yes it's spring cleaning that's yes. what we're doing spring cleaning and reorganizing the rv it's much better it is it's, it's much looking nice better <laughs> <laughs> I've been outside all hot and sweaty trying to get all of my grilling stuff ready and I think I've got it all. I've been going through that and organize it and uh, packing up because we have a trip that we're getting ready to do. This was so not the best day to choose. It it's is, like a hundred degrees. It is full on summertime here in Florida now, but I think yes. it's hot everywhere. It was it like is. 97 degrees. So we'll let Abby take over because she now has everything ready. Everything's gone. We only took 78 trips out you know, out of the camper, but yeah, we, we're we done. We thinned it out so that thinned we can it out. bring more stuff in. Exactly. <laughs> so under the bed is totally empty. Uh, we just have the shoe bins over there and some water. This bin has uh, been transformed. Okay. So now it holds the towels and battleship because you got to have that. Battleship and then you got extra toiletries mm -hmm. over there. So that kind of things that you're not grabbing all the time is going to be right. over there. And then we, uh, we had to have a place for cookbooks. So cookbooks. Cookbooks. My flannels uh -huh. for whenever it's cold. Right up there is where we keep like our hats and Yep, and my gloves. sweatshirts have made it over there, my backpack. Right. Okay. This is all tidy. Yep. Got the it bathroom. all tidied up. Totally tidy. So uh got our clothes all organized in there. Yep. And then so this was the towels and all the bins with all the medicines and extra stuff, so that is now a closet. It looks cute, it doesn't looks it? And then you got extra towels on the bottom. I do. Our beach towels the... are down there and the uh, extra towels. Okay. It looks We're great. Ready. It looks and then, great. of course, this looks better. 
Yeah, so I, I finished uh, getting this organized in there. So we've got plastic bins for different types of uh, food. That's my coffee pot there. But it's still, I mean, we still have a lot of stuff here, but we've thinned out, yeah. reorganized it, put what we really needed in there. Uh, I was going to mention, this is where we keep our rain jackets. We just use some of those command hooks. And we've got our rain jackets right here. Uh, potato chips hang up on those hooks right there, you know, things like that. And then my uh, baking bag will come out whenever we ended up using that. It's more of our spices on the door right there. So maybe some of those things will help some other people out with their organization. Agreed. I mean, we just kind of figured this out on our own once we got to Kodiak. Yep, I think we have probably rearranged things 10 times at yep. least because it just, it's yep. like things never quite work out or this is right, but it's, you know, what do I do with this? So there's lots, always lots of little cubbies. Yep. But to point to the to what we were showing you today in the video today is really taking the opportunity and going through all your bins and all your cabinets and all your drawers, pulling everything out, reorganizing it, and, and pulling out the stuff that you know that you're that you don't need. Yeah. It reduces some of the weight and 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 reduces some of the clutter and gives you a little more space there so that when you do when you're on a trip and you pick up something that you that you want. You got somewhere to put it there, you know, like a new t-shirt or a new sweatshirt. Always a new t-shirt. <laughs> Always. Well, we, plus, now we're ready for the redecorating. Redecoration is on the way. It That's going to be next in line. I'm going to hang a bunch of stuff. Hanging some pictures and some uh, yeah, pretties. Some of the stuff that we got on our, on our trip. <laughs> and uh, yeah, it's going to look really cute in here. It yep. already she's, does. She's going to be changing the cute. colors up. And yep. uh, so that's going to be coming up probably within the next month. We're, gonna, we're about to this take a trip. Fun. We're just taking a quick trip, uh, a local place that we love going. We're gonna be gone for three days and uh, and have a little camp out where we're just hanging out, cooking, going to the pool and enjoying being away from here and the noise and the traffic and everything. So- I have to fix that. All right, well, that's, we gotta work <laughs> on that. <laughs> Worry about that whenever we turn the camera off. <laughs> so anyway, just a little helpful video that we wanted to make for you guys. Hopefully it's gonna, Kind of give you some uh, maybe some hints or some tips or some tricks for your for your RV as well. It's easy to make things get cluttery. It does. It's easy, especially, especially when, when you're on the road. When you when you're married to Abby. <laughs> <laughs> We're out of here. We'll see you on the next video.